Good morning, everyone. Um, it is September 14th, maybe? It's Tuesday. And I thought I would take you guys on a day in the life of an unemployed recent college graduate. There's not much. I woke up, I applied for the Disney College program. I don't really know if I'm going to get in or not. If I don't, I'm not going to be upset. Um, if I do... I don't know if I'll do it. I heard some horror stories about the pay and not being able to like afford it without basically using your parents' money. So there's that. But I think we're gonna go visit my sister at my old institution today. Um, so that's gonna be fun. I like my mom song. got us coffee. Thank you, mom. She's not happy about it. Thank you, mom. <laughs> oh, also, I wanted to say that I applied for the Disney College program, um, but I don't want to go too much into it because that's not what I want this channel to be. Um, but I applied for it, I, and luckily, like I did all of the information on my dashboard the night before, so it was really easy to apply. I made sure to use like Disney buzzwords, um, but I got my confirmation email, and then I got my email for my web-based interview like super quickly, which I think is a good sign. Um, but I'm not gonna do the web-based interview until tonight because like I said, I'm gonna be away for like all day. Um, so hopefully that goes well. I know that the group chat is going crazy right now. Like they haven't even sent emails out. There's nothing on social media. We just kind of found it. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited for that. Like I said, I don't know if I want to just because like financially it might not be even possible. Um, but I don't know. There's tons of things that could happen. I might not even get in, so there's that. Hi, Mama. <laughs> we made it to OU. Oh, we're parked in front of the administration building because it's free two-hour parking. We're not gonna be here long, but we're trying to get some t-shirts and stuff for family that we're gonna be visiting soon. We're gonna go to the stadium because there's a shop there that my sister works at, and so we're gonna use her discount because <laughs> why would you pay full price if you don't have to? Um, there's a cross building that was being built my freshman year. Um, it's expensive though, so I don't know if it's worth it. I never got to live there. I, I toured, but it just was not worth it. It used to be apartment buildings um, owned by OU, but it was like $800 a month for something that didn't even have a kitchen and it was shared bathrooms and Callaway was just a much better option given that it had parking garages and individual bathrooms, individual rooms. Um, and a full kitchen so yeah but we're gonna I'll show you around the shop later when we get there but I'm not gonna vlog when we're outside probably because it's gonna be hot and I just want to get to our destination I probably won't record long there's such loud music in here Okay, we made it back to the car from getting the stuff. I'm gonna show you guys what we got. So we got this shirt for my little niece and nephew. Each one got the same one. They're both about the same size. So here's the other one. They're the Nike Dry Fit, I think. So we got two of those. And then we got these shirt, well this shirt for me, because I am an alumni. It's so cute. I love it so much. Are they so cute? Oh my God. They're gonna love them. They don't know what this is yet, but whatever. We're gonna teach them right. We stopped in Chickasha to shred some files, um, but we're on our way home. I'm wearing the shirt because I want to. Um, but yeah, I forgot to show you guys the taco place that we stopped at. It was called La Reina de los Tacos, I think. I don't know, um, but it was really good. Their salsa was really good. I really liked it. They had agua fresca, which I'm not a big fan of, but my family is, so. My mom liked it. She had the lemonade one, like the lemon one. 
Um, but yeah, we're on our way back home. I'm tired. I'm ready to take that WBI just to get it out of the way and then just start the waiting game, I guess. Um, but yeah, I think that's it. We really didn't do much. I didn't buy anything because like I said, I'm unemployed. I guess I should go more into detail about that when I get home. Okay, so I hope you guys don't mind I changed into my pajamas. I just wanted to be comfy, but we're home now. Um, and I figured I'd kind of go over like why I guess I'm unemployed at this time. Um, so when I graduated college, I did have a job. I was working a minimum wage job at a shoe retailer and I loved it. I loved my job, but unfortunately I just could not afford to live on my own with the pay that I was getting, especially in Norman. Um, rent is high and you don't get very much for what you pay for anyway. And so I just decided to move back home and we're actually in the process of moving again. So we're moving out of state. So that is basically the whole reason why I don't have a job right now. It's because um, we're literally moving like a month. It just doesn't make sense for me to have to like start a job here and then have to move somewhere else and leave that job. It just doesn't make any sense. So I'm waiting until we get there and I have my feet on the ground there. If I get into the DCP, I might do it. Um, I think it'd be fun, but I don't know. Like that's a whole other thing. If I can't afford it, I won't do it if I even get in. The plan is obviously move out of state, get settled in the new home, and then start looking for jobs if I don't end up doing the DCP. Yes, that's the reason. So I didn't want anyone thinking like, oh my gosh, she's just leeching off her parents. Like she doesn't have a job when she clearly could. No, like we're moving. I will start to look for jobs and stuff whenever we get settled in the house and everything's done and over with. But yeah, so that's why <laughs> my room is like a mess right now because First of all, I didn't make my bed, but anyway, that's besides the point. The point is, we're moving. I can't, I don't think it's smart to get a job here right now. I think it's better to just wait, but I am about to take my web-based interview on my laptop right now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I don't really know, it wasn't, it wasn't much. Um, <laughs> that's typically, that's not even typically what my day is like. Like today was eventful because I actually got to leave the house. I don't normally leave the house. If anything, I wake up, I um, get ready for the day, and then I kind of just clean around. Um, I pack a little bit, um, just whatever we can, because we have movers and I come and um, pack for us, like the big things. Um, but yeah, so I pack a little bit, I clean a little bit, and then that's about it. I mean, it's strange um, <laughs> not having a job just because I'm used to my own money and spending it on what I want, but everything will come in due time. I will have my job, I will have my own money again. It'll be okay, it'll be fine. This is just temporary. And I'm so lucky that, you know, my parents are very understanding. Um, they could be very, very not understanding. I could be out on my own right now, like not knowing what to do, not knowing where to live or having nowhere to live or anything. But my parents were very kind in letting me stay with them and letting me move with them and supporting me throughout my whole journey of trying to figure out what I want to do for right now. Anyway, I, I talked for way too long. So yeah, that was the video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and let me know what you want to see next. Bye!